Okay, so this is the Atwood <clears throat> hydraulic coupler. What I'm having a problem with is this piece that's supposed to open up when I pull that back, like I'm going to put the trailer on. If you see there, it moves it forward. Now it will allow it to uh, can't put the spring in here. If I open it up, <clears throat> put a lock in there just so it doesn't. So now it's in the open position. Right? And now if I want to get the trailer on, I have to get my finger in there and push that back as I'm lowering the trailer. So, like from what I can see, there's there's nothing messed up with the spring. This this happened after I put it back together. I replaced the master cylinder last year, but I can't figure out why that thing wants to spring forward instead of springing backwards when I when I open this up and pull the lock out and let it spring back. Okay, so now I'm locked in place. When I pull that for up, like I'm going to lift up the trailer. That goes forward instead of back. Now it's free. So if I can get it here. If I pull that up, it, it's free. You can push it back with your finger to open up the jaw so you can drop a ball in. But can't figure out how I'm supposed to get it to do that just by pulling this lever. 